morning guys uh welcome back uh local time is 7 17 a.m uh center time and we're located in coleman alabama uh current temperature right now is 61 degrees uh yep 61 degrees and no breeze and that's true there's no breeze uh when i went inside that's for sure but yeah guys uh we're on our way to pick up our next load in albany georgia uh which is the same beer load that you guys saw on my last uh couple of videos back um but this load is picking up in albany georgia and it's going to like a neighborhood uh in virginia but it's like really close to washington dc so that's gonna be fun <laughs> um we do have an appointment to deliver that uh just give me one second let me start heading out I kind of I kind of overslept a little bit, but it, it's all good. It's a drop and hook, anyways, in um, Albany. Uh, but yeah, guys, uh, we do have a uh, an appointment to get unloaded. Um, they're in Virginia, well, Virginia, Washington D.C. type of thing. I don't know how I'm gonna call it. But uh, we have an appointment for Tuesday at 5 a.m. Early morning to unload some beers. <laughs> but yeah, guys, uh, I'll see you guys later. Uh, we're gonna be taking Interstate 65 South into Birmingham. And then from there, we're gonna be taking State Route 280. Um, all the way down to Georgia. All right, peace out, guys. See you later. What's up, guys? Uh, welcome to Birmingham, Alabama. Local time is 7.59 a.m. Central Time. And we're gonna be taking uh, Interstate 20 East. After that, we're gonna be taking uh, State Route 280 to go through the city. And that's, like I said, that's gonna take us all the way down to Georgia. Uh, to go through Birmingham through the you know the, the actual city because I usually take uh, to uh, I'm sorry interstate 20 yeah I usually take uh, interstate 20 uh, coming from Georgia or going into Georgia
you guys can see it because of the sun hitting the camera hopefully when i go back and look at it it, it looks good cookies uh, earlier and I don't know that thing is like stuck to my throat Uh, welcome back. So we made it here to Albany, Georgia. 
uh, to the customer where we're supposed to pick up a, a lot of trailer and as you guys can see they're closed can you believe that so I already called in uh, to my dispatch apparently the broker or this company I don't know who they said that they were gonna be open at 10 a.m. today for me to pick up this loaded trailer and uh, security told me oh no we are uh, we're gonna be reopening tomorrow Monday so uh, now we have to back it up and just park and um, they're gonna take me away from this load and they're gonna pull me on, on another load I don't know what type of load is gonna be the next one but we just have to wait and see wow it's amazing well yeah that was it I don't know I don't know if I told you it's uh 118 uh, p.m. Eastern time oh lord well yeah guys uh, we're gonna go ahead and uh, just park it uh, we are just gonna park it and there is a, a flying J or a pilot down there so that's probably gonna I'm gonna go there Yeah, we have room. Yeah, yeah these people are close. I, I was gonna park it here, but I was like, no. Nah. I'm just gonna go. Oh, I think um, I got pre planned. Hold on. Okay, there you go. I just got all pre-planned. All right, guys. Uh, so now we're picking up in Savannah, Georgia. Uh, and it's going to Dallas, Texas. There you go, guys. Oh, uh, uh, that's going to be our next pre plan Well, our next load, I guess, because this one got canceled. So yeah guys, uh, I guess I'll, I'll catch you guys, uh, I guess when we get to Savannah, uh, we'll see. Alright guys, uh, like I said in the meantime, I'm just going to be over here um, at the pilot so I can use the bathroom. Uh, I didn't even stop uh, to get over here. so. The bathroom is much needed. <laughs> yeah. All right, guys. I'll catch you guys later. We'll talk later. Peace out. What's up guys, uh, local time is 5.42 p.m. Uh, Eastern time. And we finally made it to Savannah, Georgia at the Home Depot uh, distribution center here. Uh, once again, our load got taken away or I don't know, I don't know how you want to call it, canceled, taken away or what. As you guys saw, um, the previous uh, load, I went to go out and pick it up and it was closed. But at the end of the day, uh, we're here. Uh, we have to drop our empty trailer on F007. And uh, we're picking up loaded trailer 203253 on slot F030. Uh, oh, it's gonna be on that side. Oh, wait, did I pass it? 
Yeah, I bypassed it, yep. Yep. F007. F007. Okay. Yep. Oh, just gonna keep it. Alright, let's get to work. a little bit too early. Like I said guys, pull-ups, it doesn't really matter. I mean, no pull-ups, I mean like, getting it on the first try, it doesn't really matter. At the end of the day, it's you know, parking it safely. There you go. Really tight. Look, look at all that room that I had in the old side. But it's good to stay close to this, to this side. Since that's your blind side. Yeah, every time you, you park it, you like to stay as close as possible to, uh, to your blind, I mean, no blind side, to your driver's side. Because if you're close on, on your driver's side, then that means you're going to have enough room on your blind side. Does it make sense? Oh, that's good. Alright, let's go unhook and get our loaded one. I think it's that one. 207553, I think it's that one. Oh, oh yeah. She's still clean. Ah, oh, it's getting kind of uh kind of dirty little by little but she's still hanging in there. You know I got a clean truck so I had to Gave myself some new gloves. Look, look at that, look at that. Clean. And to be honest, I'm, I'm kind of happy that that I didn't get that load or that that it was taken away from me um, because they, they were close. I'm kind of happy that happened because uh, I don't know. I wasn't, I wasn't feeling like going back to Virginia. F030, zero, zero. so it's gonna be over here.
Yep, there she is. Three, two, five, three, yep. Let's go. Fourteen trailer. Yep, it's good. Do I have the four ways on. Yeah. Turn signals working. Yep, tires is good. I got a plate. Lights are working. Top is working. Six nine three four. What was it? Six nine three four. They still haven't given me the paperwork when I checked in, so I'm pretty sure they're gonna give it to me when I go ahead and uh, check out. Right turn signal's working. I got two more flaps. I think that used to be like a road or something. So look, it has the speed limit um, sign there. Huh. Oh wait, that's not my trailer. Oh, it's right here. Yeah, I mean, I, I don't know the weight. Yeah, I don't, I don't know the weight of this. I don't know if I should move the tan or so just leave it there. So we'll see. What's up, guys? Uh, as you guys saw, we already did our drop and hook. Uh, we're gonna be driving to the pilot on 95 here in Savannah and we're gonna go ahead and call it a day uh, we're loaded with uh, 29,657 so almost 30,000 
30,000 pounds, so... Uh, yeah, but I'm not... I'm not going to uh, scale it. It should be good. They have a soul boy here, but I'm uh, I'm tired of it in soul boy. I gotta take at least a week off. Look, look at this right on the grass unbelievable all right that's gonna be our resting place right there get up a little bit more. Oh, that's cool. Oh. We're done. Oh, finally. Finally, I get to eat. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, thank you guys for coming along with me. Uh, today, we basically didn't do anything productive. Other than the dropping hook over here, uh, we came from um, uh, Coleman, Alabama, um, to Albany. In Albany, the load got canceled because they, they were closed. Uh, we came over here to Savannah, Georgia, pick up our load, and now we're here. So tomorrow we're gonna be heading to Texas. Well, our journey begins tomorrow to Texas. But all right, guys, so, uh, thank you guys for coming along with me today. Oh uh, man, thank you guys for watching and like always, stay safe and take care. Peace out. <laughs>